tell you something that every successful person has to do, including you. Believe it or not, every successful person in this world has jumped. I'm going to tell you what I mean by that. You eventually, you are going to have to jump. You cannot just exist in this life. You have got to try to live. If you are waking up thinking that it's got to be more to your life than it is, man, believe that it is. Believe in your heart of hearts that it is. But to get to that life, you're going to have to jump. You see people in life, when you're standing on the cliff of life and you see people soaring by, when you see people soaring, going to exotic places, you hear about them doing wonderful things. Maybe you look up the street and your neighbor just gets a car every year, every two years. You know, how is he doing that? Have you ever thought, maybe this person right here has identified their gift and is living in their gift? Because your Bible says, this your Bible says your gift will make room for you. Your gift, not your education. You go get an education, that's nice. But if you don't use your gift, that education only gonna take you so far, man. I know a lot of people got degrees, man. They ain't, they ain't even using them. It's your gift. But the only way for you to soar is you got to jump. You got to take that gift that's packed away on your back. You got to jump off that cliff and pull that cord. That gift opens up and provides the soar. If you don't ever use it, you're going to just go to work. And if you're getting up going to work on a job every day that you hate going to, that ain't living, man. You just existed. At one point in time, you ought to see what living's like. But the only way to see what living like, you got to jump. And here's the problem. I'm going to just be real with you. When you first jump, let me tell you something. Your parachute will not open right away. I, I'm sorry. I, I wish I could tell you it did, but it don't. When you jump, it's not going to open right away. You're going to hit them rocks. You're going to get some skin tore off on them cliffs. You're going to get all your clothes tore off. You're going to get some cuts on you. You're going to be bleeding pretty bad. But eventually, eventually, the parachute has to open. That is a promise of God. Here's another thing. You can play it safe and deal without the cuts and the tears. And you can stand on that cliff of life forever safe. But if you don't jump, I got another promise I can make. Your parachute will never open. You'll never know. You'll never know what God really has.